Ladies and gentlemen of Avon High School, I come to you today with a, a very grim announcement. Tomorrow, February the 17th, this lovely room right here, room 274, It'll be closed, 6th and ninth period. <laughs> That's all. Good afternoon, Avon High School. I'm Jess Morrison. I'm Blake Opria, and these are your announcements for Thursday, February 16th. hospital system is offering a summer youth volunteer leadership program. Students in the program volunteer with the hospital system two to three hours per week and also attend leadership conferences. For applications and more information, stop into student services. The university hospital system is offering a summer youth volunteer leadership program. Students in the program volunteer with the hospital system two to three hours per week and also attend leadership conferences. For applications and more information, stop into student services. Now sending it over for Purple Ribbon Week Awareness. Make sure you check out the Silent Witness exhibit as you're walking through the hall. This exhibit represents people violently killed in Lorain County from 1989 to present. These people lived, worked, and raised their children in Lorain County. They were brutally killed by someone who supposedly loved them. Through this display, Genesis House is committed to break the silence about domestic violence and provide awareness in the community of our services and shelter to men, women, and children who are trying to break free from domestic violence. This week is Purple Ribbon Week. You can pledge to stand against domestic violence by signing a pledge in the lunchroom and receiving a purple ribbon to wear showing your resistance. Thanks to all the students and teachers that have already pledged not to become a domestic violence statistic. Now we're going to look at the following public service announcement. This highlights the Teen Street team's message. Warning, the following video may be disturbing to sensitive viewers. My boyfriend and I have been together for three years now. He gets me presents all the time. It's his way of showing me how much he loves me. He gave me this ring on our one year anniversary. It's like a promise that he'll always care for me and be there for me. This bracelet is from last Christmas. It was just after we'd been together for two years. This one was from Valentine's Day. He always tells me he loves me. Oh, and this? I got this from him when I said no. This, this is nothing. I just talked back once. I was being stupid. It's not a big deal. Then when will it be a big deal? One in ten American teenagers is a victim of physical abuse from their boyfriend or girlfriend. 1.5 million high school students experience physical abuse from their partner in a single year. Most cases are never reported. If you or someone you know is in an abusive relationship, please speak up. Any student who is planning on taking CCP courses or those already enrolled in CCP should sign up for the CCP Remind. Text at H-E-A-D-B-B -B to 81010 to join. Students new to CCP who sign up for Remind will now be the first to hear about signups for the AccuPlacer tests at AHS on Thursday, March 16th. If you come in early in the mornings, please remember to park in your assigned parking spot. Avon High School has already assigned parking spots to students in the row closest to the gyms. All students are required to park in their assigned parking spaces only while on campus. No one wants to tow vehicles. 
The National College Fair will be held at Cleveland State University on Saturday, April 1st. This college fair is a free event, but students must pre-register by visiting www.gotomyncf.com. That's all we have for you today, Avon. I'm Blake Obria. And I'm Jess Morrison, and these are your afternoon announcements. How about you?